kooky broad. Hmm? What's the matter? What happened? We are being evicted. What, are you kidding? I was trying to reach you all afternoon. How do you like that? A guy misses one lousy payment. Five payments. Okay, five payments. That Abe Diamond throws us out on the street. He must think I'm a Jimmy Jerk from Jerkville. Mr. Diamond's right, you know. Right, right, right. What do you mean, right? It says in the lease, if we can't meet our payments... Oh, he's a big lawyer now. Chew corporation lawyer. Why do we care what it says on the lease? Who needs this crummy, beat-up hotel anyway? It's flea bag. You know these architect drawings I showed you? I didn't tell you about my brainchild yet. It's gonna make me big in Jerry Marks. See this South Beach area? I figured we could buy it for a song, see? About three, four million dollars, maybe five million dollars. We take the buildings down, and we build a Disneyland. Pretty big blockbuster idea, huh? Now, I got three, four guys that want to put in a little... That Abe Diamond, now he picks to throw me out. The word gets around and my credit will be worth about two cents. Eh, don't worry about it. I'll figure something out. Hey, Sleepy, I'll run you a little gym. It's four o'clock in the morning. Oh, it's four o'clock. Are you sleepy? Come on, let's play cards. In 1931, when Mickey Walker gave up the middleweight crown, give me the name of the two guys who fought for it. What are we gonna do, Pop? Answer the question. Ben Jebbing, Gorilla Jones. Right, for one million dollars. What are we gonna do, Pop? Will you stop worrying about it? Hey, maybe if we sell the car. I'm gonna have to flatten you. Mm. Now, if you're gonna play cards, play. Tomorrow I'll go see Mr. Diamond and I'll ask him to tear up that stupid eviction notice. What if he don't? Then I'll go to a bank. You think my friend Marty Elkins is gonna turn me down? He'll give me the money in two minutes. Uh, I thought you went to him last month. Don't go getting smart with me, Ali. And if worst comes to worst, I'll, I'll call up your Uncle Mario. Uncle Mario? Now, that's very nice. Nice respect to show for your relatives. Gee whiz, Pop. Don't you remember after Mama died how they start all that stuff about, oh, you can't take care of me and all? So? I want to stay here with you. Look, in the first place, I'm not going to call up Uncle Mario unless it's absolutely desperate. And in the second place, I'm not going to let anybody take you away from me in the first place. What am I going to do, sell you for a few dollars for money? Now play cards and answer the question quick for one million dollars. James J. Corbin. I didn't answer the question yet. Ah, five points. What five points? Five points. Oh, go to bed. A little kid like you playing gin at four o'clock in the morning. Next thing you know, you'll be smoking and drinking. <laughs> <laughs> okay, once more. Who's the greatest champ of all times? For one million dollars? For one million dollars. That's easy, you are. <sighs> I had to punch you right in your funny little nose. Except it looks like your mother's. You know how you look like her? Look how you look like her. Little Millie. She was so good. Pop, please don't let me go live with Uncle Mario. Oh, what are you talking? I just know if you have to call him for money. Oh, I never saw such a worry, puss. Come here. You know what I'm going to do for you when I'm on Easy Street? I used to dream about it when I was in the Bronx. I'm going to buy you the biggest house you ever saw. Big as a castle. And we're going to have flowers and dogs and beautiful horses with their tails way up in the air. And maybe a big white yacht. Hmm? Yeah, I used to watch those boats go up and down the Hudson. And I used to say to myself, yes, sir, boy. One of these days, all of that is for my little alley. Me to you. Me to you? What kind of talk is that? When I grow up and be a famous scientist, I'm going to buy things for you. Hotels. Shut up. I'll do all the buying in this family. But that gives me a good idea. Because right next to that big house, I'll build a very big scientific building. And every afternoon, I can go up on the roof and watch the professor shoot rockets to the moon. Hmm? 
Now. Now, first we gotta get you a bank. Something solid, you know? Real solid. We have your name in gold letters that high. President Alley, banker. Boy, we sure could use that bank right now. Oh, go to bed. I beat it. It's four o'clock in the morning. Knock off. Don't let him call Uncle Mario. I don't want to live with Uncle Mario. Please, God. I want to stay here with Pop. How do you like that? He's going to take care of me. <laughs> and he could, too, the way I'm going. Some father. Put in a good word for me, Millie. Because if I lose this hotel right now, I'm dead. Cha 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 to the right, the night is young. Cha 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 to the left, oh don't be chicken, play me something. The cha cha cha, we'll cha cha, you'll cha cha. The night is young, oh don't be chicken. Knock off, will you? And the landlord is a goof. Oh. 